Hey guys, and welcome back to the last and final episode of 2017 of Made to Order a la Ordin. No, no, mm -mm. Mm -mm. no, no. Today we're making such a really fun and really easy cocktail. We are making some champagne jello shots. Now, when I tell you guys that this is super easy to make, this thing has like about five ingredients. Now, it does take a while to set, so I do recommend that you make this in the morning right before your New Year's Eve celebration or party. We're going to be using some champagne. Use your favorite kind, whether that's the expensive or the cheap stuff, no judgment. We're also going to be using some Moscato along with some frozen fruit and of course we cannot forget the gelatin because that's going to be the thing that hello makes jello <laughs> now say you don't drink or you want to share this fun recipe with your kids feel free to replace this champagne with some sparkling cider and some moscato with white grape juice let's go ahead and get started because midnight is right around the corner and i can't wait to bring in the new year <laughs> We're gonna start off by warming up a quarter of a cup of champagne and then we're going to add some sugar and some gelatin and we're going to mix this all together until the champagne starts to bubble. So I realized that I needed a little bit more liquid so I added like about another two tablespoons. Now the beauty of this dish is that you can pretty much eyeball and freestyle the whole entire thing. The most important thing you want to keep in mind is that you only want to warm up a tiny bit of champagne because we don't want to cook out all of the alcohol because at the end of the day this is a cocktail. We're now going to add our hot champagne into a mixing bowl and we're going to add the rest of the champagne and I like to pour it very similarly to how I pour a cup of beer because I want to minimize the amount of bubbles at the very top. We're now going to add our Moscato and we're going to mix this all together. Now this mixture will begin to thicken and set fairly quickly so you do want to work kind of fast. After that's been mixed, we're now going to add our champagne mixture into some chilled champagne flutes along with some frozen fruit. Now it's really important that you use frozen fruit because the bubbles will start to form and as they set in the refrigerator, those bubbles will also set and it'll just make the jello shots look super, super cool. Now you wanna set these in the refrigerator for about one to two hours. And then after it's been all set and firm, we're going to very carefully garnish it with some sprinkles or some like kind of little fun stars that I found at Party City. And you can also find these at Michael's. Our jello shots have finally set and I'm so excited because I cannot wait to dig into this. Now, 2017 has been an amazing year and a big reason for that is because of you guys. So I have to give you guys a super special and a huge thank you. Like, I don't know if you realize, but we started 2017 with about a thousand subscribers and now we're ending the year with like well over 8,000. Oh my God, <laughs> the channel has grown so much. So for my new subscribers out there, welcome to the family. Now I want you guys all to let me know down in the comment section, what has been your favorite video so far of 2017, what your plans are for New Year's, and what you would like to see on my channel coming up next year, because I'm already planning out all those videos at this very moment. Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be totally honest with you guys, I am exhausted, <laughs> let's be real. It was the holiday season, it is my cooking Olympics. I did a whole bunch of cooking, not to mention I also filmed a ton of videos. So I'm a little, you know, I'm a little wiped out. So I will be taking about a week or two off from YouTube and I don't want you guys to freak out if you don't see a video from me next week. I promise I'll be back sooner than you realize. Now, with that being said, Please have a happy and a safe New Year's. And until next time, I'm Chef Z, y buen provecho. Oh wow, this is really good. This is really, really good, especially the frozen fruit. Babe, you get none. I'm eating them all. So when I pass out drunk on the floor in about an hour, you know why. Because I had a lot of champagne.